Why are you walking down the steps like that? Okay, that's what dreamers do, right? Mm -hmm. They walk down the steps any way they want to. So, Zebra, what do you have to say for yourself? Thank you. You like this? This is Uncle uh, Mike's camera hoard. The prize I like, I like this one right here. I don't break it. And it goes in. You gotta press the button and make it go in. See? Yep, and Zebra Boy likes that one the best. My dad said he got that one, bought that when he was in the Marine Corps to take photos. Wow! The oldest camera that we have is the Kodak Vigilant Junior SIX20, still in the original box. Phew. Then one of the prizes is this baby, still all dusty, still has one of the original uh, cleaner jobs in there, and it's an old school video camera. Supposedly there's some World War II footage on here. Uncle Mike likes this one the most because this is the old school video camera. This would have been people doing selfies back in the day and, and vlogging their life, living the dream, using this back in World War II, holding their stick. Kodak Triumphant 940, and there's still a bunch of unused film in there, but uh, doesn't work. We could just make art with it. And then we got a... <laughs> the old school handy cam. There's probably still some home videos and whatever else on there. Some crazy shit, probably. And then we got this one. The claim is we don't know where this one even came from, and it has this lens on it. So it's, it's film, though. N none of these are. I ain't no fucking angel. And another thing I was working on today when I saw some street art and some stencils and inspired by Tucker Upper, the god, for some street art and looking at some other people and what they do, um, I wanted to try and make my own stencil. So I made the, um, printed out the picture of Hitler's doctor, um, the needle master, and I tried to make my own. So I'll show you guys what I did. I'm not very proud of it, but it's my first try, so if anybody can help the boy out and let me know. If not, I'll do it on my own and see what's up. Alright, that's what I had going on, the original picture, and then I cut it out like that. And that's like one of the first sprays I got, and it didn't look too good. So then I made another one, and it came out like that. I'm like, yeah, you know, that could be pretty cool looking. But it came out looking like that, so um, I'm not happy with that. So we'll try again. And make it work. How should I make this better? You just get something to put it on that as a brown ass, but you need to put paint on it first, then, then put it down on it. Okay. Don't try. Alright, I'll try better, okay? Okay, do it now. Alright, I'll do it right now. For you. Your turn. Hi, something like that. I'm going to take out my right here. It. No, I'm counting. No, no, no. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. What are you saying now? You can't come out because you're a mean guy. What else besides that? There is only a good passageway and a lot of glass. Am I a bad man? Yes, but in the glass where the bad man go. Okay, I'll...
All right, me and Zebra Boy are following the dream. I'm teaching the boy how to open a can of paint, and we're gonna do some painting on this uh, horseshoes that I painted to uh, coat them. Here we go. Don't turn it upside down, bud. Come on. All right, boys, this is the final product. Uh, well, not final product. Final product before dinner. Because I'm gonna get these people. Because they're nasty. They're teaching their children fear, resentment, anger, hate. Don't you think our children have enough fear, resentment, anger, and hurt just going to school? Having their parents help cough, spit, run around, say doo doo, throw, throw cuck at him. He's a human being. She's a human being. What are you teaching your children? Because they have less money than you? They, you smell better than they do? What? Kill them? You sick people. Waking 
end up inside that fucking jail behind the bars. We inspired some other kite flyers out there. Some other dreamers. Yeah, what do you think?